back everyone and we are back on Sukhumvit Soy 11 right here at Apoteca, one of my favorite favorite places in town. Why are we here tonight? Well, of course the blues, of course my man Neil, of course all the crowd that usually does come here, but tonight is a very, very special night and we're going to talk about charity. Yes, indeed. It's, they have something called Music for Kids. So what we're going to do, we're going to go for a short, short break. When we come back, we're going to meet one, one of the guys behind the whole charity uh, organized right here at um, Apoteca. His name is Jeff. So don't go away. All that when my second home with Daniel returns. Don't go away. Back in track and we are inside with my man, buddy, personal friend, Neil, nonetheless, the GM right here. How you doing, bro? Excellent, man. You? You know, good. When I, you know, when you call me and you invite me and there's some cool things going on, it's going to be about music right here in Apotheca. I'm always, always cool. But we're not going to talk about me. No, we're going to talk about Apotheca and uh, what's going on tonight. Tell all, all our viewers. Okay, basically what we've got going on tonight is a charity event. Um, it's for it's for kids who've got AIDS. Um, it's by a guy who runs it by called Father Joe. It's an annual event. Uh, it's normally at a place called Tokyo Joe's, but it closed down last year. Um, and we got offered to have the event here. And we are like, yeah, definitely, we'll, we'll take it. So it's a two-day event. Uh, basically, we've got five bands on tonight and five bands on last night. And 100% of the proceeds that we take from the bars, from the sale of the t-shirts, and from everything that we're doing with the donations goes directly to the, to the, to the charity. Wow, great. Uh, I guess uh, we're going to meet uh, Jeff a little bit later. And he, he, he's an organizer, yeah. All right, all right. So uh, other than that, so you talked about the bands. So last night you had how many bands? We had five bands on last night and five bands on tonight. Generally speaking, the bands that are playing tonight, they've all uh, given their time up for free. So normally we're a, a seven nights a week blues night, blues band uh, bar. Whereas tonight we've got a bit of rock, we've got a little bit of blues, we've got a little bit of contemporary stuff. So it's a real sort of mixture of music night. But like I say, it's all about for the kids and for the charity, you know. So yeah, yeah, it's a it's a it's a great great opportunity to you know come together, do something really good for the you know for the kids that do suffer and do it in a great way, enjoying music, enjoying great, great company, and uh, much more. Uh, what we're gonna do, we're gonna let Neil go because he has absolutely nothing to do. <laughs> Always. <laughs> I'll go get a drink, shall I? 
That you could do. Uh, uh, we're gonna go for a break. Don't go away. When we return, much more of my second home with Daniel right here at Apoteca. Don't change that channel, guys. Action. And we are back. Thank you, you're still watching my second home with Daniel, and I'm here with my man Jeff, uh, and the organizer and the fundraiser, I believe, here at the charity. How you doing? I'm good, thank you. Thank you guys for coming. Well, you know, we're happy to come and, you know, help out in any which way we can. But we're going to talk about the charity itself. Can you tell all our viewers all about what Music for Kids stands for? Uh, music for Kids is basically something we started in 2004. And uh, it's done for the benefit of Father Joe Mayer, who runs the Mercy Center down in Klong Toy. Now, Father Joe Mayer is a Catholic priest. He's been down there 30-something years, okay? He's got a big operation now, but he started out just one guy in a little shack. Our Music for Kids specifically tries to help the children that have HIV and AIDS and are orphaned that Father Joe takes care of. Wow, 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 wow. Uh, you guys, if you want more information about Music for Kids and the charity and the events, you can log on to this website and uh, you know, or call these numbers, and they'll help you out. You should do uh, email and try to help as much as possible because we are guests, after all, of the Kingdom of Thailand. So let's let's give as much as possible. Let's talk about tonight, though. Uh, you're up next. Uh, you're gonna play, or what's what's going on? That's right. I'm the last band at 11 o'clock tonight. All right, so what, what, what are you going to jam, man? Oh, man, I play, uh, we call ourselves a blues band, but in actual fact, we're a little bit more rocky as well. All right, with a rocky twist. With a rocky twist. That's a pretty fair way of saying it, yes. All right, I'm going to let you go. I know there's a lot of people waiting for you. Thanks for stopping by, bro. Thank you guys so very much for the coverage, really. Thank you. It's right, appreciated. Right. Thank you. Um, so don't go away. Don't change our channel. We're going to go for a short, short break. When we come back, much more about Apoteca, Musical Kids, Right here, don't change that channel. I'm Daniel Jeff, you're watching my second home. Ooh. The cruise at Grand Caribbean Condo Resort Padilla is a uniquely themed high-rise condominium set amidst lush tropical gardens and interactive wave pools. Fully furnished one and two bedroom units offer stunning panorama views and our attractive payment plans make this the ultimate resort living experience for families and couples, where every day in your new home will feel like a holiday. Any unit bought between now and June 29, 2013 enters automatically into our prize draw for the chance to win a Chevrolet Cruise car. The Cruise at Grand Caribbean Condo Resort Petia, where holidays become homes. All right, welcome back everyone. I'm standing here at one of the, the coolest room at Apoteca with Orly, how you doing, sweetie? Perfect tonight. Okay, um, we are. You were working for the music for kids with Jeff, I, I believe. Yes. So, w w what do you do there? Well, uh, I help with the design of the posters and the badge for the artist, and organizing everything goes well, and getting the money out of the people. That's well. That's the good part, I guess. <laughs> I guess they choose me for that. And, and would you say it's been okay until now? I believe so. I really, uh, I am confident. Tonight is a great night. All right, so uh, music for kids, uh, wh wh what do they stand for? Wh what do you think it stands for? I think it's, it's a name. Uh, it has been done for nearly 10 years now. And, uh, and I mean, most of the people coming tonight are the, the fans that always come every year. And it's like everybody is ready to, to, to make the donation. They come ready with their donation because it's, it's like a standard. It's like you have to participate to more music for kids nowadays. It's, it's the group. It's All right. All right. So if you again, if you want more information about music for kids and charity, if you want to donate, log on to this website and or this Facebook page will explain further. 
how to do, how to send money, how to get Orly's telephone number for a date <laughs> or not. So, well, thank you very much for stopping by. Thank you very much. I'm go I, you're going to go back outside and take money away yes, from people? Yes, good, we good. are still raising it. We love we this girl. We will not stop until the very, very last minute. There we go. So, well, have a good work and thank good you, luck. Man. Thank you. Okay. Goodbye. He literally just walked in. My man, Danny California. How you doing, bro? Good. Real good tonight. Thank you. Uh, All right, welcome back on the show, and thanks for having us again here at Apotheca. We've been talking about uh, with Jeff, Neil, and Aurelie about uh, the, the, the charity event, of course, tonight. But we, what we wanted to ask you is about Apotheca itself. Can you, can you tell all our viewers, blues lovers, jazz lovers, what they can expect here and when and where and why? Apotheca Club, I think, is becoming the number one club in, in Bangkok, without a doubt, for live entertainment. Um, We want quality. We like quality. This is a uh, this event this weekend is to promote uh, for poor children for Father Joe. But normally we got um, fabulous people from all around the world coming in here. Uh, we got a lot of surprise artists that show up this week and every week. So it, it makes it a little more interesting. And in the coming days, uh, we're we're looking to just just move up into the town of Bangkok, both with music and food and and uh, just a nice place to hang out. Awesome, it is indeed. And so pretty much there's live music pretty much every every night? Seven nights a week, seven nights a week. So there you go, folks. You want to enjoy a night out in the center, in the heart of Bangkok on Sukhumvit Soy 11. Well, Apple take us the place to be in, uh, you know. Log on to this website and Facebook page if you want more information about booking a table, booking a band or whatnot, or talk to Danny himself. Uh, so there you go. Thanks so much for stopping by, Danny. And thank you all the best, huh? All right. So don't go away. We're going to be right, right back. Just a small, small break. I'm Daniel. Danny, you're watching my second home. Mm -hmm.